no, no We're taking you home, 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 home And loving you so, 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 so Oh, I don't wanna know No, 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 no. We're taking you home, 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 home Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to make these last minute Thanksgiving DIYs. So if you're new to my channel, please go ahead and subscribe to my channel. And if you so if you hear that I sound sick, it's because I am sick and I have like a cold and a fever right now. So for these yarn garden DIYs, all you will need is some yarn and some scissors. So all you're going to want to do is get your yarn and start wrapping it around your fingers until it's like a lot of yarn wrapped around. And then after that, just take that off your hand. And get another piece of string so you can tie that through the middle of the yarn or yarn ball you have right now. So just tie it up like this. So once you've tied it up, just cut the excess string off and then just put your scissors through the loop of the, um, what's it called, the yarn and start cutting it up so it can look like a pom-pom. And then you can just start trimming it so it can look like a rounder pom-pom. And then you'll be like that. So for the tassel, all you're going to need to do is cut pieces of string or your yarn up. Just cut like five or like seven of them and then just put them together. And then just get another piece of string and do the same thing as you did like with the pom-pom and just like tie it through the middle. And then once you've done that, just get another piece of string and like tie that on top of the tassel so you can like wrap it around the top so it can look like a real tassel. And then I just did that and then I just created like a little loop so I can put my string through it so I can hang it. So just make a lot of those, any color and like how many you want and then just put them into a garland and it comes out like this it comes out so cute so for this next diy we're doing a candle holder and this is like the literally the easiest one so you will need like a container some fake leaves and some candles so the first thing you're gonna want to do is get your leaves i just got these like at dollar tree and then i had a sticker so i just took it off the um container so after that just put your um leaves in the container and your candles on top and just light that on and it's it's really simple and really cute. So for this last DIY, we're doing leaf decor. So all you will need is like these leaf plates or leaf wooden stuff like that. So I bought these at a thrift store for 75 cents. But yeah, I'm sure you can find these like at Michael's. And you also need some paint and a paintbrush. So I just painted my leaf wooden leaves or whatever you want to call them until it's completely covered with paint. And after that, you can write whatever you want with some black paint or whatever kind of paint you have. I just wrote, um, thankful and I think I wrote Thanksgiving? No. I wrote fall and Thanksgiving. That's what I wrote. And that's pretty much it you guys so i hope you guys like these ideas and if you did like these ideas please go ahead and like share and subscribe and yeah i'll see you guys in the next video or christmas video i might say so bye guys the way I used to love you, oh, I don't wanna know No, 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 no. who's taking you home, oh, oh, oh I'm loving you so, 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 so The way I used to love you, no, I